who are the three key players, and it's easy to say Peyton, other than Peyton Manning, who are the three key players uh, on offense or defense this weekend? For the Broncos? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, other than Peyton Manning. But, yeah. um, I, I think, uh, well, either Ronnie Hillman or C.J. Anderson have got to give him something. And then I think um, I think Paradis is going to be uh, key with those two pass rushers, Matthews and Julius Peppers, still both very effective. You know, th that team only has three fewer sacks than the Broncos, so they can put on a pass rush. So th those are those are two. Uh, Emmanuel Sanders is their best offensive player, and I disagree with Troy respect, respectfully and wholeheartedly. I wondered about that. <laughs> you have to put Emmanuel Sanders in the slot, and if you don't do that, your offense isn't going to be as good as it can be. That's the route Peyton Manning needs to throw, and that's the receiver he respects and trusts the most. So put him there, and you don't worry about him getting hurt. But I'll take it outside of that, Demarius Thomas is getting paid big bucks. He needs to start making big plays. And if Peyton Manning can't throw Demarius Thomas the ball to get Demarius Thomas big plays, then they signed the wrong Thomas. Because Julius Thomas, you can think he's a lightweight. I know that he disliked the Broncos organization, but he ran routes that Peyton Manning can still throw. And, and those interior positions, wide receiver positions, tight end, slot receiver, you got to beef, beef that up. You got to. Yeah, I would just add to that that uh, we saw last year, to get this year, that Peyton Manning's no longer able to throw outside the numbers very well. Right, not deep, not yeah. after, not beyond 15. So years. it has to be inside more, and, and he lived off that in Indianapolis. Uh, he he would throw to the slot receiver and tight ends. That I think you, I think I agree with you, and I was so totally opposed to Sanders being in in the slot, but yes, put him in there. If he's going to hurt his shoulder, he's going to hurt it wherever he hurts it. And put Bubba Caldwell outside and then use uh, use the other two wide receivers on occasion. But Bubba is, in the exhibition season, he was so dependable. He was their best wide receiver during the exhibition season. Let's see him some more. But, uh, have Bubba, Bubba outside and, and then bring yeah. Benny Fowler along yeah. and, and you know rotate him in if Benny yeah. produces, give yeah. Benny more time. So you and I agree about that. Uh, defensively, Brandon Marshall. Uh, not just in the run game, but somebody's got to keep an eye on Aaron Rodgers and keep him from moving around too much. It's, you know, it's probably the job of, of both the defensive ends, uh, Malik Jackson and whoever's on the other side, Antonio Smith, whomever, and the two outside linebackers. Derek Wolf. And the two outside linebackers in, uh, in DeMarcus Ware and Von Miller. And, and I don't doubt for a second that, that Von Miller is getting a lot of attention, and that's allowing the, the, the whoever's on the other side, to Marcus Ware or Shaq Barrett, to, to shine. But, you know, um, Von Miller could use a game where you just go, oh, he is the best player on the field. And, sure. and, and so I will say, come on, Von, let's dial it up just a little bit. Got no complaint against you, but let's dial it up a little yeah, bit. Yeah, because I read something this morning, and we're six games into the season, that Von Miller's going to, if he's franchised next year, that's a big number. Yeah. If he's not franchised, he's going to expect, we're talking about the new $75 million person, if not $100 million. Well, Vaughn, you need to start earning that. Even though the defense has been great and people talk about, well, Vaughn's doing a lot of different things. He had the strip sack and the recovery and everything. But Vaughn Miller, if you want to be the J.J. Watt kind of numbers, uh, Sue numbers. Justin Houston. Yeah, you've got to, he's got to start earning that or he's going to be the new Demarius Thomas of, guys, you're the franchise guy. Uh, we'll franchise you for a couple of years and then let you go. Yeah.